So Facebook just came on. So hi Facebook. So I've been on TikTok cooking. I cooked a couple of different meals this morning. Um, but if you're struggling with the holidays, drop struggling in the comments. If you are new to me, I am Tanya and I am um, <clears throat> have been on a keto journey for the past year and I have struggled with the holidays before, but I did not struggle last year. That is one thing I did not do. I did not struggle last year. I did not have to worry about the holidays. I didn't have to worry about Thanksgiving. I didn't have to worry about Halloween. I didn't have to worry about Christmas. I didn't have to worry about any of the holidays. And the reason is, is I made a decision that I was gonna do and be a better version of myself. It, like I said, Facebook, you're just hopping on. I am pre-doing my um, preparation for my bacon. We ran out of bacon and my son was like, oh, where's the bacon? Where's the bacon? Well, I had to make a platter of bacon. So bacon is finally done. I've been on, live on TikTok. I don't even know. So what I do is I prepare. If you're struggling with the holidays, number one, you have to, you have to prepare. Number two is... You have to make a decision. What What is your goal? Is your goal, sorry, I gotta move TikTok for a minute. Is your goal to stay healthy and not drink, not drink, not eat, not do all those bad habits that usually happens during the holidays? Some people don't like the holidays. Some people don't like it because they know that they're gonna be vulnerable. They know that they're gonna be not able to control themselves, whether it's it's drinking, the eating, Halloween, it's the candy. Um, I saw a meme this morning, which was so funny, and the meme was, um, it was a woman's hand, like a mom's hand in the candy, like a big, huge thing of candy, and it says, this is what we do on November 1st when the kids are at school, because they just got all that candy on, on the 31st, and that's what they're doing, is they're going to be um, eating their candy while the kids are at school. Um, that's not me. I'm not a sweets person, but that still would not be me, because I made a decision not to not to eat the candy, not to eat the food that I'm not supposed to. I'm still going to eat exactly what I need to eat to stay healthy. I'm still gonna move my body every single day. If you're struggling, dro drop struggling in the comments. I know exactly what you mean because I've been there. I was there for years, years upon years upon years upon years. I struggled my entire life. I grew up in low low income household. I did not have I was not taught what I was supposed to eat, what I was not supposed to eat. I wasn't, I was literally eating just to get by kind of thing. I was eating the bad through foods because that's all we could afford. My um, mom was a single mom. She was disabled um, for a majority of my life. She died when I was young. Um, young saying I was 20 and she was only 46. So she was pretty young. Um, but that being said, I wasn't taught a lot. I had to figure it out for myself and it took me a long time to figure it out. I would figure it out and then I would fall back off track. I would figure it out and then I would fall back off track. If that is you, drop fall in the comments and I know exactly what you mean because that was me for many, many, many years until I made a decision and you may not know or you may, um, need something to help you and that's what I needed. I needed something that was going to help me figure out what I needed to figure out to stay consistent and to stay on top of my health journey. And if you are new to me, drop new in the comments, but I drink ketones every day. It are these little packets that you shake up in water um, and they put my body in keto in into ketosis. If you don't know what ketosis is, ketosis is when your body is Literally, appetite control, mental clarity, focus, energy. I get so much energy drinking ketones that I don't even know what to do with sometimes. I end up cooking a bunch of things. I end up going to the gym like last night. I went to the gym for almost three hours last night. That's the type of things that I would do. Not on purpose. It's just I needed to focus on my health journey. And the only way to do that and for me to be consistent I was never consistent. I had a hard time being consistent. 
if that was you, drop me in the comments. I could never be consistent. I was constantly going back off, back off, back off. And I was like, what, what is wrong? Like, wh why can't I stay consistent? Why can't I do what I need to do to stay on my health journey? And then that's when I found ketones. Um, I've been drinking and sharing my story with ketones since um, September of 2022, um, a little over a year right now, and I've dropped over 50 pounds, and I maintained it for several months, probably like three, four months, I maintained it, and then I realized I know what it is. I'm not going to the gym and I'm not as active. I'm still drinking ketones, but I'm only maintaining. But if I'm active and I'm actually doing what I'm supposed to be doing and I'm eating what I'm supposed to be eating, I will drop the weight. So I literally started going back to the gym almost every single day or I move my body every single day. If I'm not at the gym, I'm moving my body. If I'm not um, moving my body, I'm at the gym doing something, weightlifting something. So if that's you in the comments that you are struggling with that to stay on track, just message me because we have a coaching program. I created my own um, inside of the coaching program of the ketones and I help other moms, women that are struggling, grandmas, other women that just they need to get their mojo back. That's what, that's what happened to me. I, if you don't, are new to me and you don't know, I am a mother of twin boys. They're now 15 years old. I still cannot believe that. It feels like yesterday they were born because I literally remember the same day exactly what I was doing, exactly where I was going. Yeah, they're 15 years old right now. And it took me a long time to get back back on my mojo. I would get it back and then I would lose it. I would get it back and I would lose it. I would get it back and I would lose it. If that's you, drop me in the comments because we align with each other. Um, there are many men that um, they go through the pregnancy um, time with their wives. If um, that's you, drop me in the comments. I know what you're talking about. My um, husband ended up gaining weight um, while I was pregnant. He ended up um, not being on a health journey and not um, being aligned with himself. Or even afterwards, he wasn't doing what he had to do for his health. And a lot of people um, say, oh, I tried that, I tried that, I tried this, I tried that, I tried this, I tried that. Let me tell you something. I was not this size without some kind of work. You have to do some kind of work in order for you to be successful. Um, I had to make a decision. And sometimes you have to have something to kick yourself in the you know what in order to be able to help you with that decision. And if you want to decide that you want to lose 5, 10, 15, 20, 40, 50, 90 pounds, I have... I have the meal ticket. I have the way. I literally drink ketones every single day and it keeps my body into ketosis and it keeps my body healthy. You have to keep your body healthy and it, in order to do that, you have to have some kind of something to curve your appetite, something that's not going to have those cravings. I don't have the cravings that I used to. All I do is I shake up one of these packets every single morning or I drink a keto up or a keto kick, something to kick my body into ketosis and I'm not gonna have to worry about grabbing the bad foods, eating the bad foods. At night, craving for snacks. At night, craving for stuff that I shouldn't be eating. That's exactly what I do. I drink these every single day. Um, I also make sure that I eat healthy. I'm not eating the garbage that I shouldn't be eating. When I go out to dinner, I make sure I am eating a well-balanced meal. I'm not, if you're not a huge person on like vegetables and stuff like that, I put it into stuff that I like. So then it doesn't even bother me. I'm getting my nutrients in. But also these little packets have a lot of nutrients. I've sent so many labels to people and they're like, wow. That's a lot of vitamins. Wow. That's a lot of magnesium. Wow. That's a lot. They just wow me over and over. I cannot believe that that little one packet, that little drink has so much, so many benefits in it that because if you're looking for mental clarity, 
like focus, drop focus in the comments. If you have trouble with that, if you need something to curb your appetite, drop curb in your, in the comments. If you need something for better sleep, because I sleep so much better now that I drink ketones than I ever did before. I would wake up in the middle of the night and be like, why am I, or not be able to go to sleep. Why can I not go to sleep? Or I would constantly have cravings for stuff that I shouldn't be eating. Alexa, turn off. Alexa, turn off. Alexa plays some of my motivational music throughout the day. And that was Alexa playing with my one of my motivational music. So it's live. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. And this is what happens. Motivational, motivational music on Amazon Music. She's about to play motivational music for you guys. Alexa, go home. Alexa, turn off and go home. I didn't catch the other thing you said. Go home. I think she listened this time. I guess you can't say Alexa that much. Alexa, who's going to win the, the Super Bowl? Good afternoon, Tanya. I thought about picking the Dolphins, but it's been 50 years since they've made a solid splash in the postseason, and it's likely their playoff hopes will sound something like this. <laughs> Alexa cracks me up. Keep asking, who's going to win the Super Bowl? Every week that you ask her who's going to win the Super Bowl, she says a different answer. Last year, it was hysterical. Every, every, every time I would ask her, it would be something different. But anyway, back to what I was saying. I am not struggling anymore. If you are struggling with the holidays, please message me. I did drop the link here. I can drop the link on... I think so. I thought I could. I don't think it's letting me. Um, oh, comment. I can drop it here for, for um, TikTok. But I dropped the link. I dropped the link in the comments. Just definitely connect with me. Um, if you want more information about ketones, it's in the link in my bio, or you can just grab um, the link that I just um, put there. I'm telling you, ketones have it's not like anything else that I've ever tried I've tried so many different companies I've tried so many different supplements so many different ways of changing my appetite changing what I'm doing changing everything I've never had no bloating in my stomach like I have no bloating bloating now like I am literally not bloated like I used to be I was literally bloated like I was pregnant I felt pregnant all the time um not I can't say that I felt pregnant with the twins because when I was pregnant with the twins I looked like a house I really did I look like a house so it wasn't that type of pregnant um feeling pregnant it was just feeling that bloatingness that it's the uncomfortable bloatingness feeling drop bloating if you in the comments if that was you um make sure you share this out thank you Sharon for sharing this out I appreciate you thank thank you Stephen for hopping on thank you Rhonda for hopping on hi Colleen but yeah bloatingness a big thing um I started drinking ketones boom like instant I just had somebody that bought my um my breast cancer bundle um not last week, the week before, within one week, actually, I don't even think it was a week. I think it was a couple days of her drinking ketones. She lost four pounds. She lost four pounds. And that's just fat loss, fat loss of, I think it was water weight because the bloatingness is a lot of water. Um, fat loss is a huge thing with, um, because it controls your appetite. When it controls your appetite, you're prone to lose fat loss. And that was like my biggest thing. She is down four pounds, um, of fat loss and she is so excited and I am so excited for her. Um, she, um, does, does want to lose another six. 
um, so a total of 10 pounds. So it doesn't matter how much you want to lose, 10 pounds, 20 pounds, 30 pounds. If you want any kind of fat loss or if you need mental clarity or you need more energy, energy is a huge thing because people struggle with energy. You know, I'm a busy mom. I'm always running around. Like this morning I had to run to to go drop off um, an allergy pill to the to one of my twins because of the fact that he didn't get he didn't get a chance to take it this morning because sometimes um, with the change of weather, his allergies kick in. Not severely, just he just needs a little one that's going to like help him throughout the day. So I had to do that. Like, that's the other thing. Th there's a business behind these ketones packets. I sell trials. I um, drink these every single day. I'm a busy mom, so I need the energy. I need the energy to be able to to be able to function. Like, I remember I used to work eight, 10 hour days and I had no energy. I don't go through that anymore. I have energy like un, un, like unlimited amount of energy. Like, I don't, I don't even know how to explain it. It's hard to explain the amount of energy that I have compared to what I used to have. I was the couch potato. I didn't, I didn't really, I mean, to be honest with you, I didn't, I didn't play with the twins like I should have when I was a couch potato. Um, I didn't go outside and I didn't exercise and I didn't have any motivation. I've been consistent in drinking these ketones for one year and I dropped 44 pounds in four, less than four months. It was less than four months. And it's because I created a coaching along with other people just to do um just to create a lifestyle that you don't have to worry about struggling struggling with the holidays I don't do it struggling with financial with the holidays I don't do it this business and also with between the business and drinking ketones I don't struggle I don't struggle anymore like I used to and I I was tired of struggling I didn't want to be in corporate anymore I didn't want I started online businesses because the online businesses is where it is because financially you can't depend on one income and if you have one income and you're looking for another income drop two in the comments you can't look for an one income like one income is not going to do it for your family and there are some people on here that I know I, I know some people on here um, on TikTok and on Facebook that have more than one income they're not just one income um, family they're four income families because mom and dad are both doing more than one income me personally I have several incomes and <clears throat> I chose to do that because I have more dreams. Like I have several houses. Um, that's just my preference. I rather have more than one house. I rather have more than one um, lifestyle that I live than just the daily thing. I like to travel. Um, I don't like to work for anyone, so I work from home. And I teach other people how to work from home. I teach people how to cook. I teach people how to sell trials I teach people how to get their health and um, their health back I teach people how to be an affiliate I teach people how to promote products um, there's a list long list of things that I help people do and if I don't what are you eating sorry my dog was eating something and I got to make sure because sometimes he gets a little crazy with his eating so um, I lost my train of thought but yeah I literally help people if I didn't do it I don't I, I can't teach you how to do it but I've done everything that I promote everything that I do I teach other people how to do it um, it's I don't have anything to hide um, some people want to come on to social media and they don't want to say who they are I'll tell you exactly who I am my name is Tanya Close and I am a mom of twin boys I'm married I um, live in Pennsylvania and I plan on becoming a millionaire the first millionaire in my entire family and if that's something that you are looking to do or you are you have that goal or what whatever your goal is maybe it's not a million dollars maybe you just want to make a hundred thousand dollars a year maybe you want to make 
um, $50,000 a year. Maybe you want to make $20,000 a year. Maybe you just don't want to, because I talk to a lot of moms, maybe you just don't want to provide no income in your family and you're just a stay-at-home mom and the stay-at-home mom that wants to start help providing for your family. If that's you, drop mom in the comments. I, I get it. I get it 100%. Um, there are so many moms that I've helped already um, do the same thing and it may be just they want to go get their nails done or get a pedicure whenever they want without saying I need money for this. I need money for that. I need money for that. That is so many people and I've helped so many people do that. Maybe you just want to be able to get a new car. You don't want to have your beat up car anymore. Maybe you just want to buy a new car. Maybe you want to afford that car payment, whether it's $300, $500, $600 a month. Well, this right here, no income plans, but I can help you sell trials and you can make that car payment every single month. Um, it's it's that easy. It's really that easy. I just I have I have an Escalade and I just paid off my Escalade last month in October. I just paid it off. Um, that's how that's and that's how much of a game changer that this business and whether it's the business or your health, either one. I can help you, but. I've been on live with TikTok and I have to pack trials. I'm not sure if I'm going to pack trials on Facebook. It depends um it depends on how many orders that I have. I might be back on, but I definitely have to pack I just packed up these yesterday and they need to go out, so I just need to put um tape them up and take them to the post office and i'm going to do that before um they close today and then i'm going to get all the other trials out that ordered last night and i got three notifications i think they were orders and i'm going to do that too so thank you for hopping on thank you for sharing this out i appreciate you on take tiktok and facebook um you can always catch me live, whether I'm talking about food or business or what I do. If you ever have any questions, you can either ask me on my lives or you can literally connect with me in Messenger. Sometimes it's hard on TikTok, so you might have to come over on Facebook or Instagram, but I'm always at your fingertips.